even get this? Why is this going so fast? Anyways, I could have sworn one time I did a live, uh, live stream, but apparently it's saying that I'm not, uh, you know, I can't do it now, but hey guys welcome to my channel this is your girl pisha coming to you guys with just an update to see how everyone is doing during during these difficult times with this quarantining and just staying in the house you know um i just came on here to we're not doing an update i'm just on here because I'm, I'm gonna cut a couple of my ends and i was like let me go ahead and try to do this live but apparently they don't allow you to do it live anymore i don't know why which is kind of weird i gotta figure that out why i can't do my videos live but i don't have the time to figure that out right now so basically i'm just on here saying hi to you guys and um telling you guys what i've been up to like that right there gotta go i found these scissors in my um bathroom and decided to go ahead and use those so i'm just cutting my ends here you know your hair naturally wants to um shed so i guess this wanted to shed you can see my two strand twist where i started my locks right there at the end and yeah no that's in. And then I have another one here. Where is it, Ashton? This one right here? No. That I need to trim. I think it's this one. This one right here needs to go. I'm gonna go ahead and trim that as well. This one here has to go. The one right here. This one's still strong, I think. Give me the one from the back. Yeah, this one's a double-headed dragon, which I feel like I could definitely get rid of. That one, kind of going. Do you see any other ones in the back? Like the ends? So what's up with you guys? What you guys been up to? Um, me, on the other hand, this is week two. This is week two of me being in the house. I think I probably went to work once. And um, they decided to go ahead and close everything down. Because I am in the dental field. And, you know, I'm not trying to get sick. So... I'm glad they did that. They pretty much like, pretty much like laid everybody off. Um, this is another one, but I think I'm gonna leave these. They pretty much like laid everyone off uh, to further notice. We don't know when. And so I'm just basically home, homeschooling my son and uh, pretty much making zero dollars. So if anyone out there has a job for me that I can do at home, I'll go ahead and leave my email down below. You can go ahead and contact me <laughs> that way. Anything blogging, anything to do with online, let me know down below. I'll go ahead and leave my information down below. So I'm pretty much here homeschooling my son. Um, he's going nuts. We don't have anything to do but stay in the house. Um, so no work for me. Um, I tried to get on the unemployment site today that didn't work out it literally kept kicking me out like literally six times and I just didn't have patience for it so I said I'm just gonna go ahead and set my alarm tonight about three o'clock in the morning get up in the morning and go ahead and try to do it around that time because I just don't have the patience it's like why is everything like government things always either like take so long or it just doesn't work, you know? <sighs> Guys, I'm just going nuts. I mean, it's only so much TikTok videos I can do. It's only so much Snapchats I can snap. Um, 
yesterday we went for a, I went for a run um, and I was even thinking about like uh, should I be doing that because at this point I feel like this thing is in the air you know because I was like watching a couple of videos on Instagram people saying that they they have been quarantined and they haven't been allowing people in their home and they caught it so at this point it's like is this thing just in the air cuz I don't know so today I decided to go ahead and stay in the house actually I lied I went outside on my beach chair and put it outside and sat out in the Sun for about 15 minutes until my skin started burning so I was like oh my god I need to come back inside I did that um, and then we did absolutely nothing we um, did a zoom call with Ashton classmates with his teacher we did that oh oh I went out to go get something to eat you know have my gloves on e even then th even that's a hassle I don't think I'm ever gonna do that again I got a gift card from his dad and I went we went to go ahead we went to Longhorn and I had my mask and my gloves on and even that was a hassle because it, although I had all that on like you don't know who's packaging your packages so I got home still had my gloves on took all the um, containers out wiped them out wiped them down with my Clorox my Clorox wipe right here that I have here wiped down all the containers and threw the bag out took my gloves off washed my hands before I could eat I mean even that's a hassle um, I mean we're talking like this is just out of hand because you know on the news is saying that people are just going to the grocery store not, you know what let me go ahead and scratch that we know someone my mother um, uh, maid of honor from her wedding she lives in Orlando and she said that she went out to the grocery store the other day and she saw somebody licking the produce like what is going on in the, in the world so not only you know we already scared to go out to the grocery stores now when we go out to the grocery stores not only we have to wear our gloves we need to go ahead and wipe down every piece of container every piece of thing that we bought from the grocery store every fruit vegetable we need to be washing with soap what is this world has come to i mean i feel like this shit that we should have been doing <laughs> Excuse me, Ashton. Sorry. There's the things that we should have been doing before, but uh, I guess. I mean, now we we need to be more aware of what's going on. So, so you know, go grocery shopping and wipe down every container before. I mean, I'm, I'm not going to be. My sister saw someone doing it. She wiped down all her containers before she put it in her vehicle. I won't be that uh, uh, particular about that, but I would put them in my car but once I get home I will wipe them down and then eventually go back in your car and wipe down your car um other than that that's um that's just what we've been doing just staying here there's only so many YouTube videos I can watch just going nuts like the rest of the world we can't do anything there's nothing for us to do um you know, all I, all I can do is in the mornings, I when I have my coffee, I go out on my patio and I can only pray for the world and pray for everyone that is affected by this situation. You know, no one know um, how it really feels until it's someone that you actually know and that's actually your family that is affected by it. And um, that's all we can do at this point is pray and wait until um, all this is... Um, Resolved. Other than that, um, I haven't, you know, done a retwist or anything. I just decided to go ahead and cut my ends. I don't know why you want it. And oh, something new. I got my. I got a nose ring. Um, I got that pierced about two weeks ago. I think it's cute. Um, I had my septum pierced before, but I took that out. I got this pierced before. I'm more like a piercer. I like to pierce everything in my body until I get bored and I, and then I take it out. Yeah, I got a couple of my ears. And then I take it out and then I move on to something new. But I got my nose pierced before all this happened. And um, that's pretty much it. I just wanted to come on here and say hi to you guys and see what you guys are up to. Um, comment down below let me know what you guys are doing with your kids 
um, what kind of games you guys are playing. Because, you know, I know we can't go outside that much. I got a bike that I can't even go and ride. It's nice and hot in Florida right now. Can't even do that because I'm, I, I literally think this thing is like airborne and it's like, oh my God, what if I, you know, get it? Um, so that's pretty much it. Like, I don't work um, because I'm in people's mouths all day, every day at work. So we can't even use hand pieces. We can't even do anything. So I'm just out of work. Um, I just can't, yeah, this is <laughs> pretty much it. Um, anything you would like to share, Ashton? When my teeth came out. Oh, yeah. He, um, actually, no, it did not come out. He had me take him to my job so the doctor I work for can remove it because he was in the bathroom trying to pull it out himself. I tried to, what I did, I tried to put a um, floss. floss around it and tie it, and it was in there. So I was kind of afraid. So I guess after he loosened it up a little bit, it started to bother him every time he would chew and stuff. So then he was like, oh my God, I want it out, I want it out. So I was like, okay, let me go ahead and tell um, the manager over there to go ahead and put you on the schedule. And um, at that, that day that we went in, they only had two patients. So um, I went in into my room, carefully wiped my room down, uh, got everything ready. And then um, big boy got it extracted, got it extracted with only topical. He didn't even get a shot. He only did the topical anesthetic. So that's not a big boy. You are a big boy. Well, big boy didn't even budge, didn't even cry. And, you know, the doctor just like I took guess. it out. I know. I'm like, ah! Yeah, and then he pulled it out. And, and I was like, I can't go. And then he got some money from the um, Tooth Fairy. Tooth Fairy. Tooth Fairy broke these days, you know, coronavirus. <laughs> But, you know, he got something. How much did you get? Um, it was a dollar. No, it was a dollar and what? 25 cents. It was a dollar and 25 cents. I heard that from I didn't know it in the first place. Yeah. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, like I said, comment down below. Tell me what you guys are doing. Um, if you guys want to see our corny TikTok videos, I'll go ahead and post my TikTok uh, information down there, down below. Um, and that's pretty much it. Um, thank you guys for watching. Just an update. Wanted to see how you guys are doing. Be safe. What is that? Keys. What keys are those? Keys. I need this. This is my suitcase key. Can you go ahead and put my suitcase key back where you found it? Be safe out there. Don't forget to, you know, wash your hands constantly. And I'll see you guys soon. See you guys later. Bye. Bye.